Hey guys, welcome back to Struggleville YouTube channel. For this video, I have to show you my new ashtrays. Now I know, this is not something that everybody will be able to appreciate, but people who have been in a similar situation as myself can definitely appreciate nice, shiny, new ashtrays. Because what happened was, these are the back ashtrays for my 66 Caprice, and here's all the different vehicles they fit. A bunch of stuff between 60 and 67, right? So it shouldn't be that obscure of a part or that hard to find. Oh, no, no, no. I checked every one of my known parts places, and they didn't even have a listing for these ashtrays. Didn't have them at all. I didn't know what I was going to do because look at mine. Okay, it's not like the worst thing in the world, but that is not pretty. And then when you open it up, it's even worse inside there. And then you got the little trim ring, beauty ring kind of guy, and it looks pretty awful too, right? So trying to clean things up on the Caprice, make everything look nice and pretty. I couldn't find these nowhere. After doing a bunch of searching, I finally find one place that I'd never heard of before, but they had them for like 67 bucks for a pair. I got a second one in the box over here. So $67, which, okay, that's a bite in the ass. I'm not real happy about 67, but it's the only way I can get these ashtrays. I started Googling the company, all I find is people leaving comments saying they bought stuff and never received what they bought. Oh, now I got a chance, 70 bucks after tax and shipping or whatever they charge in addition, on maybe getting some ashtrays, so that sucked. Then I found an eBay seller that had these things. Of all places, eBay had it. Now I've been finding out lately that eBay is very reliable for these old car parts. They've had a bunch of stuff that I haven't been able to find other places, and then eBay had it. So I was shocked. I'll leave a link down below to these things if by chance anyone ever watches this video that actually needs these, because they are hard to find. Okay, so here's how they go in and how they come out, because we can at least make this video somewhat uh, educational for people. So this is the ring that it sits in, right? And it just pushes right in like so. There's nothing that actually holds the Astra other than just a little friction fit there. So this is mounted in the rear armrest, and you have these little tabs on the side. It's just these two right here. And they bend down over the armrest so it tucks up underneath here, bing, like that, right? And it's sitting, and this just drops in. So what I did was, and I only had to get one of them, I got this hook up underneath there and pried this thing back, and then I was able to lift this side and pull this side off. And bada bing, bada boom, it's off. Now, because these are so hard to find, this is going in a parts box that I keep because it could get cleaned up a little bit and if something ever happens to these other ones, I know this is a difficult part to find, we gotta keep it. I didn't even know I was actually getting this ring. I thought I was only getting the ashtray. So this was a damn bonus to get an extra piece. But you can see this one fits just like so and then we open it up. Boom! Look how pretty that is. So let's put it in real quick. Time for the shiny new chrome. Boom, look at that. Got one on the other side too. Looks good. Now when the parts come in, we got another project going on too. Thanks for watching.